Hello, this is ANGOP's national highlight. In this edition, we bring up the opening ceremony of the third legislative session of the National Assembly, as well as the speech on the state of the nation made by the President of the Republic, José Eduardo Santos. The National Assembly formally opened its third legislative session of the third parliament period, which will focus on the beginning of the debates aimed to clarify and prepare the schedule for the 2017 general and local elections. The new parliamentary year, whose opening session included the parliament speaker's speech, Fernando Díaz dos Santos, We'll also focus on the issue related to the live TV broadcasts of the debates and passing of laws that favor the people's well-being. The parliamentary leader recommended the MPs for a patriotic attitude in order to standardize the democratic environment in the parliament. The official opening ceremony was also marked by the speech on the state of the nation. The President of the Republic, José Eduardo Santos, was at the Parliament to comply with a constitutional provision and addressed to the Angolans about the state policies. The Head of State spoke of the preliminary results of the census, the need of diversifying the economy, the projects related to social and economic sector, as well as the local elections, one of the most expected items of the speech. At the end of the session, several assessments were made around the speech of José Eduardo Santos and the works of the Parliament. Anxiety and expectation were the remarkable feelings in the solemn opening ceremony attended by 200 of the 220 elected MPs as well as hundreds of representatives of the executive, legislative, judicial power, the diplomatic corps, the ecclesiastical and traditional authorities. On the occasion, officials of the ruling and opposition parties shared the same scenario to know how the state of the nation is on a day when for the first time the issue of local elections was touched at the highest level. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you in our next edition.